Hello everybody, this is Havoc and welcome back to Norland, our medieval colony sim RPG-S game that combines Crusader Kings 3 and RimWorld in its most basic definition and form. This will be the last episode, we have a 25 day limit. And so we'll hit that 25 days 100% today, so we're going to see what we can't do to completely and totally wrap this thing up. Now, last time... We had a lot of interesting things. We tried to assassinate Wind Peak. It didn't work. It didn't work well at all. And instead, what we decided to do is we decided to take it over. Naturally. Makes sense. And so part of me wants to continue the destruction of everything today. Simply because, well, simply because I can. Now, Moon Lake isn't something I'd be able to take on. Neither is Starstream. But dadgummit, Dust Valley only has five people. Sparksville only has two so like yes please i could demand some vassalage yeah we we're in a little bit of a pickle in terms of our people we can't walk for whatever reason our daughter died last time that's right i did forget about that and hmm, we need to satiate our uh, our wife's vet uh, who did have an affair with uh, or not with us against us last time yeah, she's definitely pregnant with someone who's not our uh, not our kid. Now, I don't know the details of that. It doesn't really go into... I don't couldn't find the person that uh, they they did it with. <laughs> so, we got we to gotta figure that out. We have a lot of unemployed people. This is true. And we need to continue working. Uh, that's okay. We can continue working. What we can do is we have our coal furnace which we can't upgrade just yet, but what we can do... Oh, never mind. The uh, the person who had that knowledge, unfortunately, died. It appears that uh, Iska had the knowledge to build a workshop and things of that nature. That's extremely unfortunate. Uh, so we're going to have to relearn it, or can we not even learn it? It may have also been someone who was within our realm. That's also extremely possible. In fact, that's probably much more possible than anything else. So we are going to roll with that. We did gain some uh, some great gold. And we're going to start our next day. Now, how are our people? Our people are actually pretty good. Interest in the character, that's fine. A child is born, Silover. Now, remember, Silover is not ours. He's not ours at all. Uh, however, he will be ours because he's born into the family. So that's a little unfortunate. I'm not super, super happy with that. But what we're going to do is we're going to let Havoc, we are going to let him uh, give his orders for the day once everyone's awake. And then we're going to go conquering again because I basically, I need to conquer. I need to do it. Uh, we actually might uh, get these guys killed real quick. And then we may go and conquer Dust Valley because, well, if I'm going to conquer these lands, I need to make sure that these guys aren't a trouble that I'm going to have to deal with in the future. So we'll kind of feign. What is it? We'll, we'll feign like we care. But really, I just want to get some extra gold and eliminate a threat for whenever I do take over. Sveta has low loyalty. So what we need to do is we do need to give her some rings. We need a gift. Unfortunately, I can't gift anyone rings, and that's very strange. Very strange. Regardless, we're having our service, our morning service that she is leading. There we go. All right, we're good today. Now, our crops aren't going to do well because we do have some issues with, uh, with the drought. Loyalty is bad, so why don't character receive a reward from the king? Let's go ahead and reward her. And that might help us a bit. Now, we have a polite demand of tribute. Uh, <laughs> no. No, thank you. Uh, that's not going to work. Not one single bit. Now, unfortunately, these guys are allied. And so, if we were to go up against them, I don't know that we would be able to attack them. Or that we would be able to uh, go up against them effectively. So, we can do lots of things. We could assassinate a lord. This requires 400 gold, which we don't even have. So, we couldn't even do that. Okay, cool. Well, what we're going to do here... Ooh, here we go. King decides it's time to announce an ambition. So we did an ambition before of getting 65 people in. Now that we have completed that, we need to expand your alliance of free cities to three provinces. A daily production of goods worth 1,953 gold. Yeah, we're going to be a conqueror. We're going to try and do all that stuff. Now, what about these guys? Let's go with... I don't want to demand tribute, but what about a peace treaty? 
Cost of the church mediation services will be 200 buckaroonies. I don't know that I want to do that. All right, what we're going to do, we are going to go attack. Create our new squad. We're definitely going to throw a good number of warriors into the mix here. And away we go. Now, again, remember, we're, we're, we are noble in nature in a way. We have our tribute coming in, which is going to really help us. But yeah, we're definitely just trying to to get as much done as we can before our 25 days are up. All right, what's up with this little lady here? She has some injuries. She's menopause. That's fun. She has some sins with a forbidden child that's going to take a few days to get over. And, of course, she has some scars. Now, she has some shame from her sins, so we could probably have her absolve that. If we confess to the bishop, she will be ready to rumble, and that will be very good for us. That's what we need. We need her loyalty to be higher. <laughs> we need her relationship to be better, but that's kind of what she gets at the same time. But we need her right now at this point. There's no one else that's suitable. Not as far as I can tell anyways. So we need to make sure that she stays loyal to me and doesn't uh, run away, basically. And once again, someone is also bribing her. Not a big fan of that, but it seems she her loyalty is going up. Her mood's a little bit better. So hopefully that doesn't uh, do much to sway her and that she can still stay with me. Now, again, the reason why we want her to stay loyal, one, she's my wife. Two, we need her for orders. If it's just up to Havoc alone, he's not going to be able to do it all. Our kiddos are not yet old enough to do anything orders-wise. Abandoned by parents. What does that mean? Oh, we need to care for them. Okay, well, we'll focus on that when we get back. All right, she'll be good. All right, let's fight this. Should be a rather cut and dry thing. It appears we've got a little bit of a bugged <laughs> thing with uh, Sveta not wanting to go away. That's all fine. That's all good. Let's go ahead and attack them. Now, it looks like they have uh, two archers compared to our six. So we should be able to really harp on them. There we go. I can't wait to have like really, really big battles. Because these look like they'll be a ton of fun once we get uh, into the big, uh, big tall things. Big tall things, big, big battles is what I meant. Come on, archers. Do your thing. There we go. There we go. Come on. Keep fighting. Keep going. Brilliant. Okay. Now we have our archers that should be able to take out this archer. If everything works well, go after them. There we go. Brilliant. Okay, cool. One, uh, two are dead. We've captured four of them. And we've come back with some goodies. And then we need to take care of our kiddos. We definitely, definitely do. You are not abandoned by your parents. You are being tutored. Still over. I, I kind of don't want to do anything with you. <laughs> I just I just don't. Uh, there's no one that they can perform the action this. But they can confess. That may help her loyalty quite a bit. And then we have evening activities, or is this bedtime? I do believe this is just evening activities. That's what it appears to be. All right, no worries, no big deal. We are making positive uh, gold at the end of every day, so that's good. Oh, never mind, it's the day. It's the beginning of a new day, <laughs> excuse me. Oh, lordy. All of these days are running together. It's hard to keep track of all of them. What do we have here? Spend time with... Yeah, let's have some spend time with Sveta. Maybe that'll make her a little bit happier. Hopefully. Hopefully. Uh, what do we have now? Hiding under the hem of a women's skirt as soon as you're asked sides. Two sides in the conflict. Oh, wow. King Ludasil. King Ludasil. Hey. Hey. Now, now. None of that. None of that, dear sir. Don't get salty. Uh, can I have these people... We may switch up the idea here. Hmm, Bidun King's Dremel and a Mencot from Sparksville. His neighbor has organized terror against the peasants of the culture of the city. Demands an immediate stop. A Mencot believes this is his personal affair. Dremel demands you publicly mark your position in this dispute. Hmm, that's not something I want to commit to. Not right now, but that's all right. We will get rocking and rolling and all the stuff and the things. We do have a rather like... Uh, good amount of beer we're gonna limit it to a hundred and that way i can at least sell it and we won't over flood the market um but what we can then can turn to is moonshine and maybe sell that quite a bit as well uh sveta mock the villain here come come on come on sveta you are you are doing this to yourself at this point and i don't appreciate it uh she has a desire to go hunting okay well we can do that for sure what is havoc's desire his desire is to go hunting as well 
Well, we need to hang out with our kiddos, but then we also need to go in and do that. Okay, cool. Your vassal has decided they are no longer willing to be under your crown and challenges you. Well, just, right? Like, come on, people. We've got a lot going on, and I wonder if we stayed and vassalized them again. I wonder if they would be, like, really good or not. I don't know. Lots to think about. Sveta's loyalty. I am too busy. Your lord is not able to distribute instructions. I know we need someone else, and I'm hoping that our kiddos will come in and be able to do something. Sweet. We're good there. We need Havoc to come in and talk, because if we do, if we don't do this fast enough, then we'll build up a huge amount of wealth, or I guess fees from our Lord that we just can't, uh, we can't contend with. Oh no, Havoc has the Rutabaga fever. <laughs> That's terrible. It's terrible and terrifying. Oh my word. Okay, cool. Well, we are going to flood the market just a little bit. We're going to, hmm, we could actually use that, so I'm not going to worry there we go. They end up owing us money, which is exactly where we want to be. There we are. We're going to flood the Rutabaya market. They end up owing us 215 buck a runies. Now, we don't really need any more uh, medicinal salve, but what we do kind of actually need is we do need some spears. Uh, we can't get any armor because our relationship with the church isn't good enough, which I think is a little bit bonkers, but it is what it be. And then we can come over here. Management. Lords and warriors will be twice as skilled in using bows. I think we'll be okay, but what I do want to get is a good handful of meat that we can trade. We're going to do that. Thank you very much, good, kind trader, sir. And we do have a free lord that can be hired, and that's what we need. Oh, and unfortunately, we don't have enough rings. Okay, well, we didn't want to spend a lot of money on rings anyways. I don't know what that was about. Drusasil? Well, regardless. Okay, you are... Yeah, you're going to get sacrificed. Or no, you won't. Okay, okay. I was like, that's pretty drastic. But I guess whatever works. That's what you get in a way. Twisted, weird way. All right. We have a lot of employed. Our Lord is too busy. Unfortunately, I cannot get Conlith to come in. Uh, okay, we're, we'll be all right. We'll be all right. Havoc, you need to go wolf hunting with Sveta. And that's fine if we have to do it in the middle of the night, but you can do it in the next day. We only have five days left. So honestly, we may not even see the result of this. This was a two-day cooldown. And so we need to have our morning sermon. We will then go in, do our hunting, and then maybe, just maybe, we'll come in and we will go... Ooh, nice. Skills have been increased by five. We can gain our loyalty with our wife and then go and put down our vassal rebellion after we give away our orders and do all those things. Time to go wolf hunting. Maybe Sveta, I, I don't want her to die, but maybe that's what she needs. You guys go hunting together though. There we go. There we go. Is her loyalty higher? It's getting there. Her desire has uh, been satiated for now anyways. All right. Uh, Severina will soon require an available lordship. I'm not sure what we can do. Let's see. Your king can bestow these titles on children's warriors and hired free lords to make them part of the noble family. Okay. Number of titles cannot be increased, so if you have a growing child, make sure you have a free title, or else they will become a free lord and go to your neighboring king. Interesting. Limited number of lordships. So, like, basically, we can say, hey, you are going to be... Uh, we can take out that Check out that. In just 13 years, she'll become an adult. Maybe at 13 years is what they meant. Surely not by 25, because if that's what it is, that's a really, really long time. Avic, you need to start issuing orders, my friend. Please and thank you. Or just don't. Can we capture him? Who is this person? You are the son of Dremel. I'm pretty sure Dremel was the guy who knocked up my wife. Hmm. Maybe we don't deal with it right now. Because it doesn't look like Havoc is going to give away his order, give his orders like he should be. Nope, that's very unfortunate. We really needed him to give away the orders that he, <laughs> we really needed that to happen. And he just straight up didn't. Havoc, you are a disgrace. All right, new heir to the crown is Flora. Hi, Flora. Can I grant a title yet? Doesn't look like I can. So what are her traits overall? She's actually pretty daggum good in management. I really wish I could just hire her right now, but I can't. Whoa, 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 what is this? Oh, snap. <laughs> oh, no. Um, Yeah, she's coming to kill me. 
she is coming to kill me. The air and rising in rebel. The air is rising in rebellion. I assume she's coming to kill me. Oh no! Fight, lads! Fight to the death, please. My love, you son of a biscuit. I have my archers coming in. Oh my freaking word! Yes, Sveta's passed away. You daggum right she has. She freaking like. Oh my gosh! No, let's go after this dude. Go after him. Dag gum it man like seriously well while we're at it i guess <laughs> oh my word uh, okay well we have a rebel vassal to deal with we're just gonna go ahead and send that army son of a freaking biscuit now we need someone to to marry i guess the real question is is there someone like that because we don't have yeah we don't have anything we can't have uh, anyone take over so havoc is gonna have to do all this stuff shoot and have it can't go trade either i don't want to capture him that's not going to do anything good for us grayland is back hey what's up grayland uh you want to like you want to join me no 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 okay fine be that way well just shoot my daggum wife literally just like killed tried to kill me straight up we now have forest bandits in our land as well they stole some rings from me which means i now have to contend with that stuff we lost a person here, apparently. Oof. It is not a good day for us. And we may lose this. We may end up losing this. And that's hilarious, considering all that's happened for us. Six buildings need a manager. I understand. There's nothing that I can do. Oh, my word. There's Seriously, there's not a single person that can help me with this. Good lord. We have to fight this. We just don't have a choice. And they are stacked to holy Moses. This may be the end of uh, end of our run. Yeah, this is definitely going to be the end of it. How are we surviving is the real question. I don't know, but we are just barely. Head over this way, you fiends. Oh, you're not going to lose now. You're not going to lose to a couple of archers. No siree. There we go. All right. Unfortunately, three have died. Two have escaped. That means we should have uh, we should have six, eight. And then one dead, five escaped, seven have been captured. You've triumphed against my will, but I swear by the Holy Sophia, my fight for freedom has only just begun. Well, then we just may have to burn them to the ground, is what may just happen here. Because just freaking ridiculous. And now we have a new prophecy. The bones foretold a disaster, the invisible moon rise, the blood will freeze from the hunger bowels of the flesh wolf. Beware of wild beasts and be prepared for their attack. In five to seven days, the church's seers expect the following disasters. The appearance of an invisible moon in the sky will drive flesh wolves mad and compel them to gather in large packs. A pack of six to twelve flesh wolves will attack the center of your city and kill everyone they see. After a day, the pack will flee in search of a new settlement. Good Lord Almighty. Oh my word. Zord's been captured and currently in captivity? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, my wife doesn't deserve a funeral. Can I say no? Because no. Yeah, those flesh wolves just attacked someone. Oh my word, our empire is falling apart right before my eyes and I absolutely love it. The funeral has begun or has it already ended? Well, Savetta does not need it at all whatsoever. We need a barracks. We have a very weak army. I have a barracks. We still have a very weak army. Uh, we actually only have uh, apparently one warrior. Three of them died, apparently. Total number of warriors are six. Okay, that's that's fine. Havoc is unable to move, and no one wants to go pick me up. Super fantastic. I love it. Okay, apparently we had three warriors. Okay, there we go. Oh no, and they got freaking attacked by flesh wolves. You gotta be kidding me. This is actually, I mean, it just, it, it is humorous. As messed up as it is, it is humorous. Cutthroats are breaking into the house. That's fine. We don't have anyone to do anything against them. Oh, my word. They'll do what you must, I guess. Like, nothing I could do. Well, while we're at it, we might as well try and seduce. Interest of Nefir towards Havoc is low. Oh, well, that's rude. Okay, Nefir is our captured noble that we captured from the last time. Now, in theory, uh, Sarivna should be able to do all the things... Unfortunately, Havoc just, he's going to have to take over everything. Uh, no, we can have Nefir do it. Okay. That's not too bad. I didn't know we could force her, but I guess as a captive person, 
She kind of has to do whatever we say, isn't that right? I mean, technically. Let's have her do that so that way we can share the load. Buildings need some managers as well. She's not really doing anything, so we can go there. Okay, what's going on now? Conflict between neighbors. Uh, polite demand for tribute. We should probably do that. Yep, I wasn't able to do any of that stuff. That's fine. <gasps> Ooh. Bright has a price of 214 buckaroonies, but that would get us... Our lord doesn't treat us well enough. Of course they don't. 100 buckaroonies. I just don't want to do that. We could go here. Oh, here we go. Bandit camp near your city poses a threat. Oh, never mind. Can I just hire them? They've changed. Requires 350 bucks. Okay, well, we can be able to do that, and we'd be able to, to boost our, our army a little bit. Ceremony should take place, but again, I wish she didn't, uh, she wouldn't be able to. Because she does not deserve it in any way, shape, or form. Finally, we're giving orders out. About flipping, flapping time. Because goodness gracious, this has ended up being a wonderful, beautiful disaster. Eleanor is leaving the settlement. I can't, I can't keep him. No, I can't keep him at all. I'm not going to bribe him. Hold on. Loyalty will, it will decrease. Magnitude of loyalty decreases in the target. Depends on the persuasion skill. We can undermine some of these people. And I'm wondering if we don't do that. We could get a rebellion in Rayotulub. Uh, Radolub, excuse me. Because Rurark is the king. I have to think of something. Because we are surrounded by alliances as well. Oh no. This dude is a vassal of these guys. <gasps> Interesting. Oh my word. I wish we had more than two days left. Because, man, that's a really interesting development. They finished paying tribute. Great. We're definitely still going to try and get these guys in. Once they get into the settlement, we'll go there. It's time for the Lord to marry. I know. For sure. The treasury is nearly empty. I know. For sure. All right. The Holy Caravan's here. We're going to have Havoc go in. Do some negotiating. Nice. All right. So we have our vassalage uh, tribute coming in from our vassals. So we only owe 264 bucks. <sighs> now, what we need to make sure we do is that we come out on top in this because I don't want to embarrass myself. We have... Oh, there we go. We could do that. We need to order some ale, maybe. Maybe some more... How many... We have plenty of those goods. This has increased in price dramatically, but I need it. So we're going to buy it. We have plenty of scrolls, so we don't need any of those. We could order a handful of those. There we are. And then what we're going to do is we are going to... We don't need to sell any of that stuff. We can sell a lot here because we did just get tribute. There's that. And then, of course, our rutabaga. They're going to owe me 275 bucks. That works. That's a good trade. And then what we're going to do is... Oh, shoot. What was I going to do? Oh, that's right. I was going to pay these guys. We're going to hire them. We're going to send a messenger to do that. We don't need to attack that. Are there any more people anywhere else? There's no more bandit hiring that we need to do here. Now, I could go over and I could attack these guys in the future. And I would be able to get uh, some relationship building things. But at this point in time, I'm just going to be happy to be where we're at <laughs> uh we can't spend any time with anyone and that's the weird thing we haven't been abandoned by our parents but we can't do anything to interact with them it's a little bit strange the dust valley valley has become our enemy cool that's awesome seven bandits have come in and joined us which means we'll have nine we could go ahead and take these guys over but we're probably not going to have enough time to do anything with it <sighs> quite a pickle Quite a pickle we are in. I am going to... Can I not seduce? There's no performers available. I'm wondering... Then you can join him to your faction. Her to the faction. We have a lot of rings. So we're going to go ahead and have Havoc come in and do that. But Nefir also just had a nervous breakdown. <laughs> oh no. Uh, this building is broken. What does that even mean? We have to restore the functionality of it. What the freaking crap? That's rude. Uh, we should be able to grant titles now. She's 13 years old. Laura discovered a strong desire within themselves. Okay. Nafir and Sarivna have started a fight. You've got to be kidding me. Okay. I think they're okay. Oh, it's Nafir. She's just, she's, that's her breakdown. She just starts. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was a lot of notifications that just happened. Flora has come of age. Sarivna has come of age. A new heir to the crown is Sarivna. We have a request for uh, assistance, a polite demand, and then we have another house that has fallen. We are bickering nonstop. 
And in the midst of all that, houses are falling left and right across the outskirts of the empire. All right, so what we need to do, oh, awesome. There are slots. They can be assigned stuff. Heck, the freaking yes. So we are actually going to remove Havoc from all of these. And we are going to free him up to be able to do the things that he really needs to do. Now, unfortunately, I cannot repair that. That's not going to happen. The fair, we can't seduce Havoc. You got to be, you got to be better than that. Hmm, King Rourk, I just don't know that I care. I don't know that I care. I'm going to keep her here, though. I'm going to have her spend some time with me. I think that might be a good idea. And then all of our peeps will be able to kind of go in between all of them. We're going to have, we're going to spread that out. Awesome. Unfortunately, because my daughter died, um, we don't have even more people, but that's okay. But what do we have here? There's a battle there. That's going to be a pretty cut and dry thing. Flight demand for tribute, a request for assistance. Dremel from Dust Valley is becoming stronger and plans to annex Wind Peak. Uh, they can try. Well, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to... Uh, we can't do this with the Suzerain, but Sparksville is the Suzerain, right? Oh, no. Dust Valley is the Suzerain. Okay, that's fine. It's a little weird that we can't do that with the Suzerain because we should be able to. We're going to go ahead and demand vassalage. I think that's the, the strong point here. I can hire bandits, but I don't have the money to do so right now. We're going to do that. We're going to demand vassalage. We're going to send a messenger, and that's just how it's going to be. Now, we're going to remove nectar consumption from Nefri. We can definitely allow them to wear all those things. Our production's going well. Unfortunately, like I said, we're not going to be able to do much. But we've at least set things in motion to where in the future, well, it's going to be a little bit of a pickle. I don't get why there's so much fighting going on. Are people really that discontent? I fear they might be, actually. They may be rather discontent indeed. We have a lot of unemployed. It's time for me to marry, but no one wants to marry me. Be married to me, I should say. He doesn't like me enough. Should be at least plus five. How about this boyo? He's at minus 25. He's got a rather large army too. We wouldn't be able to survive this run. That is for sure. And everyone... Everyone's just starting a drunken brawl. That's just what we have going on here. It's fantastic. I love it. Oh my word. Seriously. Everyone is just in a big giant drunken brawl. I think that's pretty indicative of the, the, the state of our little town right now. My word. We have a dangerous neighbor. We have a dangerous neighbor indeed. They've challenged the authority and soon provide their response. Yep, they're not going to do it. Don't worry, friend. Don't worry at all. We're going to go ahead and send a ransom acquisition. We are going to send a messenger for that as well. The Lord is in depression. Man, we have a lot of stuff going on here. None of it positive. Not a single bit of it. Uh, have the traders? Nope. We've already missed that. We missed that showboat. We could have hired more bandits, but it's not going to happen. We have so many things going on. Oh, my word. This is ridiculous. All right. The morning, the last day, and the end of our story. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I hope you enjoyed this journey. We probably would not have survived this run. In retrospect, having three daughters at one year old each puts us in a little bit of a disadvantage. But it would be a fun. It'd be a fun playthrough. I really enjoyed my time with this demo. I hope you enjoyed watching it. If you did, be sure to not only do the things to support this channel, like giving it a like, subscribing, or leaving your comments, but you can also wishlist Norlin now. The release date is due out in May. I hope you appreciate it. I'm going to play some different scenarios offline. Maybe you'll see some more content on it. I really don't know. But this has been a blast, and I hope you've enjoyed it too. This is Havoc, and I'm out of here.